Hello Cancerians and welcome to January reading or whatever is left from January reading uh, from January sorry we had two eclipses I didn't rush into doing the readings I didn't really feel like it and I wanted to wait for the eclipses to go uh, very emotional really I suppose it, it's not bad emotions necessarily it's just you know um, stirred up emotions it could be excitement for some or it could be feeling down or sad everyone um, picks up on it differently and is being affected differently obviously depending on their own um, birth chart but one thing is for sure most are affected it was the last uh, lunar uh, the last eclipse in Leo this uh, past um, full moon lunar eclipse and that is about the self so changes about us that we need to make and it's very important happy new year as well by the way as it's the first um, reading of the year it's um, important to pay attention to these changes and shifts because they are going to affect us for the next pretty much 20, nearly enough 20 years two decades so is um is paramount that we are going to get this right and the best way to get it right because the north node which is about the future is now in cancer which is all about emotions is to make sure that the decisions we are making are going to make us happy and feel good about um about it for a long time so cancerians i am going to freestyle it and give you whatever messages i'm getting so far i got the queen of cups which is the card of cancer well water sign normally but it is your energy obviously since i'm doing your reading and i have um here the three of pentacles which is about changes in um home situation some of you in the ace of cups so some of you could feel these emotions as i said either way positively or not so um positive some of you will be moving home some of you might have been out of your home normal home environment some of you may be looking at um, making some major changes or investments within your home environment some of you may be investing in buying house but however whichever um, applies to you guys is going to be good because you got the ace of um the ace of cups which is about shifting and feeling better so you will be i believe following <laughs> the guidance and do what makes you feel good I have the tower here and um, you don't have to worry about it the tower is about things that you can't predict going completely into restructuring so everything has to go down to the ground in order to be rebuilt and then I got the six of pentacles which is another um, like the three of pentacles another card of foundation and again combined with the tower again um, very much about stability and foundation so whatever you have built that was not right is going to change you have a complete start i was saying about changes as well earlier so a complete um, reboot if you like emotionally and also on a material level more material level some of you may be dealing with um, some um, official matters and official people uh, but then since you may be doing investments or changing um, important things in the house that probably involve money some of you may be dealing with gemini's as well Librans and Aquarians because that's the these two are air sign um, energies more not not Aquarians so much but it 
I wouldn't completely exclude the possibility. However, very much Libra and Gemini, very much about truth, very much about honesty, very much about cutting through the bullshit as well and finding balance because this is the card of... Um, is the card of finding balance is also the card of giving and um, charity as well. So let me see if I can clarify this one. So you may be helping somebody or somebody may be helping you. Maybe you have helped and you may decide enough with helping other people or some of you might have needed some support and you're not getting it. So you have to toughen up and do your own share and sort things out yourselves so this is about whatever's been delayed some of you might have as i said waited for house movements been delayed um things or property whatever to do with property and assets for those that applies to um have been delayed but things are changing you're doing things in a completely different way now um, if you've been waiting, as I said, for some support, some money to come in, they have been delayed and you have to go to authorities and speak and put your point across. Um, if you have, because, um, you know, there's been deceit and, and an anxiety. So I got the seven of swords here and the five of... Um, Want, which is about feeling deceived, feeling anxious because things were not so, you know, it looks like you've been, um, you lost out on something or you could have and you had to avoid that. So, you know, it took a lot, um, it, it took its toll on you, by the way, however, everything happens for a reason strangely enough i was seeing that the other day on my um on social media i don't understand why double negatives are not um, encouraged in um, the english language because nothing to me if i would hear it nothing happens for no reason which is the double negatives is more effective more punchy has more of an impact than saying everything happens for a reason. So whichever way you want to look at it, the, the bottom line is don't worry about what seems to have been lost because something better is coming to you. So whatever regrets over past decision you might have, please don't because things are changing for the better for you you're moving forward um, and it's going to be like a blessing in disguise and you are going to get the news that you are hoping for i will have a look and see if i get anything about emotions in respect of relationships as well because i feel this is very much on a very individual level so this is very much about how you felt about the things that you had to deal with and I feel that a lot of the Cancerians had to deal with things on their own as well. So it was really hard because you felt like you don't have the support. But there you go, the Ace of Pentacles. Yay, you're getting money, guys. And there's no salary. This is not about the regular income. This is like a windfall of some sort. Um, so you get good news about money coming your way. So exactly what I was saying earlier on, whatever the price was, you know, that struggle, it was worth um, going through it because things are improving for the better. So let's see if we get anything about um, love and relationships. You're holding back from, I got the four of pentacles and I got the page of cups. You're holding back some of you from expressing your uh, feelings. Some of you may be waiting to hear some good um, loving communication and you're a bit attached to that outcome. And some of you may be um, hoping and being attached to a child. I got the, um, the Empress speaking of a child. 
but also some of you may be attached to the idea of being parents or becoming parents again take whichever applies to you um, and then we have the seven of pentacles which is about making a choice so let's see if we get anything there a wish comes true oh how nice is that cancerians this is the wish card the nine of cups you will have to make choices you will have to act but you can make your wishes come true and i feel that some fiery energy or um foreign element a person who is either a foreigner not necessarily to you it could be foreigner in relation to you but it but it could be foreigner in connection to the place where you both live because i don't see long distance between the two of you so you um you know they can be of different um of different ancestry to the country where you both are but this is the kind of person that can make your wishes come true or the kind of energy it can be a person or or an energy whichever again whichever applies to you or for some of you it could be a fire sign energy and fire signs are aries sagittarians or leos so i really hope you're very Pleased with the good news, Cancerians, I am for sure. Um, oh, and there you go. Um, <laughs> I just, I just glanced and noticed the, the Knight of Cup. Oh, Knight of Pentacles. Sorry, the Knight of Pentacles. So this is about um, again um, foundation. So somebody helps you put down, lay down foundations for your future and you will be happy and your wishes will come true I'm, I'm very very pleased with your reading it's really nice i feel such a shift in your reading guys positive shift i hope you're going to share this so others can hear the messages and feel better about the you know things that are coming their way i also hope um, you are going to subscribe if you haven't already if you did thank you remember to hit the bell to get notified when the next one goes up remember to give it a thumbs up as well if you liked it and um until next time be loved and be happy